We are gathered here today to sip some tea, honey. So make sure you guys have your teacups ready because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, it's your girl T, and I hope everybody's doing good today. Make sure you guys have your teacups ready. Get ready. Y'all get ready. Yes, you get oh, ready. Because this tea is what? Piping hot. Hey, you guys, it's your girl T, and I hope you guys are doing good today, honey. I know y'all have been hitting me up. Y'all been wanting me to talk about the whole Khloe Kardashian, Tristan Thompson situation, but I didn't want to jump on the store. I wanted to wait to get some more information. And when I tell you this story is super messy, there's so many people involved. I mean, this entire situation is re damn dickless, but I'm here for it, bitch, okay? So, anyways, so what's going down is this. So, what happened is that yesterday, Tristan Thompson and Khloe Kardashian started trending and it was leaked that basically Tristan Thompson has been cheating on Khloe Kardashian for months now okay so what first happened is that basically there was a video that took place back in October when the Cleveland Cavaliers were getting ready to play the Wizards and basically in this video you see Tristan Thompson in a club in DC and he's kissing not one but two females okay so he's kissing these women the video goes viral folks are going in on him and then a few hours later a woman named Miss Stephanie she takes to Instagram and she just starts spilling all types of tea okay she's saying that she's not the woman in that video but that she had also hooked up with Tristan Thompson she has pictures of herself in bed with him she released a video of her and him having you know sex or whatever kissing and things like that and then she also released some freaky ass text messages and listen to what Tristan Thompson was telling her. Tristan Thompson to sit his long eggplant ass down somewhere and stop passing his damn peen around like some damn Tic Tacs because on top of fucking Miss Stephanie back in April he also fucked another woman her name is Lainey Blair and she's not been identified she works as a bartender in the strip club and basically she's the woman going with him to the Four Seasons Hotel with the Louis Vuitton bag So now she's been identified. So this is not one, but up to four women that Tristan Thompson has cheated on Khloe Kardashian with. But now this is the craziest part, okay? As of an hour ago, Miss Stephanie just spilt the tea and basically deleted her entire Instagram account. Delete all that shit! Delete all that shit! Because Khloe Kardashian fans started attacking her, but she basically put it out there and she said that she also is pregnant by Tristan Thompson. When I tell you, honey, this entire situation is a hot damn mess, but I'm here for it, bitch, okay? Like I told y'all before. Now, on top of that, honey, okay, I've noticed a lot of folks have been going to my Khloe Kardashian and Tristan Thompson video that I did two years ago, and a lot of folks are seeing that, once again, Negro Domus was right, okay? I know a lot of you handsome hoes hate when I call myself Negro Domus and I pull receipts and I show my flashbacks, but you handsome hoes are just gonna have to be mad, okay? I got a flashback for that ass. I want y'all to go ahead and check this video out and I'm gonna come back with the rest of my commentary. But I hope Chloe realizes. I know Chloe wants to find love so bad, honey. You know, ever since all that drama happened with Lamar, you know, I know she wants to find love. I know she wants to find a good man. And, you know, she's been kind of hopping from guy to guy to guy. I want her to also realize that Tristan may not necessarily be the guy for her. Because if he's willing to leave his pregnant girlfriend for Chloe and not even acknowledge his baby, it says a lot about Tristan Thompson. So I hope Chloe is taking notes because I would hate for this to happen to her, you know, a year or two down the line. Because it seems like he's more enamored with her and who she is and her fame and, you know, what she can possibly do to raise his star level than really being genuinely into her. Because let's keep it real, Tristan Thompson is not a LeBron James, Kyrie Irving. Hell, Tristan Thompson isn't even an Iman Shumpert, okay? So he's not like one of the most well-known players on the team, but 
people are now knowing him and people are now saying his name because of who he's with, Khloe Kardashian. And I see a lot of people who like to blame the Kardashians and say things like, oh, they're just using black men for fame and they're just using men. But I have to be honest, a lot of these men use them just as much as they use these men. You know, a, a fair trade ain't never been no robbery. You know, he's also using Chloe because of her celebrity status. So I feel like that's why he's with her because she's a bigger star than his baby's mother. Because like I said, up until now, I never heard of Jordan Craig. I don't know who she is. I didn't know she was related to Nico. So I feel like when he felt like he could move on to somebody bigger, who had a bigger star power, who could, you know, put his name out there because fame is a hell of a drug. It doesn't matter that he's on a winning team. He's not one of the top three players that's known on that team. I'm not saying that he's a bad basketball player, but when you think Cleveland Cavaliers, you automatically think LeBron James, Kyrie Irving, and possibly Iman Shumpert if it's a good day. You know what I'm saying? But you never really think Tristan Thompson. So I feel like he's kind of using Chloe because of her star level as much as she's using him for some damn dick, okay? So Alrighty then, I hate to say I told you so, honey, but I told you so. Once again, Negro Diamond Strikes, okay? I made that video in 2016, and I was telling Chloe to be careful because the same way you get them is how you lose them. And if he can cheat with you, he can damn sure cheat on you, okay? Let's not forget that when Chloe got with Tristan Thompson, she met him at Kevin Hart and McRib's wedding, okay? McRib is Jordan Craig's cousin, okay? Who was pregnant by Tristan Thompson at the time. She was his girlfriend and fiance. Tristan Thompson left her for Khloe Kardashian. And I told y'all back then, the reason why he left her is because Tristan Thompson is starstruck. He's not as popular as LeBron James. He's not as popular as Kyrie Irving. You know what I'm saying? So he needed to find his own little niche. And the way that he did that was through Khloe Kardashian. Nobody was checking for him. His name was not ringing no bells like that until he got with the Kardashian, Okay. I truly believe in my heart of hearts, he wanted to get caught. First of all, this man is six foot nine. His ass is way too tall to be out here cheating and thinking he's not going to be spotted, okay? He knew what he was doing. He was kissing these women in broad daylight in a public club in front of lots of people with cell phone cameras, paparazzi, and everything. So he wanted to be caught. The problem is he was never into Chloe like that. He was nothing but a clout chaser. He was trying to get with her because she was a bigger celebrity than his current baby's mother. And since then, he's never acknowledged Jordan Craig. He's never acknowledged his son. So that made me lose all respect for him, okay? You've never seen him in a picture with his child. You've never seen him mention his child. He acts like his son doesn't even exist. You only see him in pictures with Khloe Kardashian and them talking about their baby on the way and all that other mess. So it shows you the type of person he is. It shows you that he's not a decent person. If you can sit here and cheat on your pregnant girlfriend with another chick and get her pregnant, you know what I'm saying, but you don't even acknowledge your first child, I have no respect for this man whatsoever. So at this point in time, I'm not calling his ass Tristan Thompson. I'm going to call his ass third trimester Thompson, okay? That's what a lot of folks are calling him on social media. Because it seems like every time a chick gets in her damn third trimester, this asshole runs for the damn hills, okay? Obviously, he's not into pregnant women like that. Obviously, he's not a faithful person. And sometimes when you do clownery, Chloe, in the words of Monique, the clown comes back to bite, okay? See, when you do clownery, the clown comes back to bite. Y'all done heard Big Monique spit that real, and that's the truth. This situation concerning Tristan Thompson and Khloe Kardashian is the perfect manifestation of how you get somebody is exactly how you can lose them. Funny how Jordan Craig lost him in her third trimester and so did Khloe Kardashian. So I don't feel bad for her at all. And when I tell you the internet done drug both they asses, folks are going in on Tristan. Folks are saying, ha ha, Khloe, we told you so. Now Jordan, the baby's mother, she has now spoken out and she's trying to take the high road. I'm going to go ahead and read to you guys what Jordan had to say about this situation. Check this out. So Jordan says, if you respect yourself and you respect others, you would not make light of the misfortune of anyone, nor would you feel indemnified when it comes to the expense of others. Wishing peace for everyone. First of all, sis, I can appreciate you taking the classy role, but miss me with the bullshit, okay? You wrote that for social media. We know damn well your ass and your homegirls are sitting here kikiing it up, screaming karma, saying, aha, that's what his ass gets, that's what her ass gets, but I understand you're trying to save face for social media, okay? But I'm 
I'm going to go ahead and gloat. I'm going to sit here and smirk because I told her ass this would happen. And guess what? The shit came to pass. Okay. I don't feel bad for Khloe Kardashian because again, how you get them is how you lose them. <laughs> So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys the comments, the tweets, and what folks had to say, honey. Go ahead and check this out, and I'm going to come back with the rest of my commentary. Fuck my face, man. Fuck my face. God damn. Fuck my whole hey. vibe, man. What more do you want from me? All right, so you guys just saw the comments, the tweets, and what folks had to say. You know, in my personal opinion, like I said, I feel like this dude wanted to get caught. I would not be shocked if Miss Stephanie is truly pregnant by Tristan Thompson, okay? You know, if he really wanted to keep this low key and he did not want to get caught, he would not be cheating publicly. You know, he was only in this for the fame, and I caught this from day one. Now that he's gotten his fame, now that he's gotten his notoriety and people know who he is, now he's ready to move on from Khloe Kardashian. He is not a good guy. He's not the type of person to settle down. He wants to be single and do him. So Khloe needs to allow him to just do that, okay? At the end of the day, you know what I'm saying? I don't feel bad for Khloe because she did the same thing to Jordan, but let's keep it real. Khloe will be all right. Her baby will be all right. It's not like Khloe's broken. She's gonna be struggling. Her child's gonna be struggling for anything. Honey, this will be a part of the Kardashian storyline. The baby will be a part of the storyline, you know what I'm saying? But the whole situation is crazy, and it does suck to get cheated on while you're pregnant. It's not a fun situation. But again, maybe now Chloe can now fully understand how Jordan felt when she had to sit here pregnant and watch her fiance basically fool la la and la di da di da all over the damn country with Chloe Kardashian, okay? So sometimes what you put out there, like I said from Jump, is exactly what can come back to bite you in the ass. So I would not shed not one tattoo tear for Chloe. And all you Khloe Kardashian fans need to have a tall glass to shut the fuck up. Talk about y'all feel bad for her and that's not right. And making excuses. Was it right when she did that to another woman? Don't talk that female empowerment bullshit, okay? When she's done this to other women. Not once, but several times. She's done this to Trina. She's done this to a lot of other women. So I don't feel bad for the Kardashians when they get their just desserts. As far as men cheating and playing their asses, okay? So anyways, y'all, let's go ahead and get the discussion popping, honey. Go ahead and leave a comment. Let me know what y'all think about this entire crazy situation once again concerning Tristan Thompson not only cheating on Khloe Kardashian with one woman but up to four different women and also Stephanie coming out and saying that she's also knocked up by Tristan Thompson so this situation is messy as hell but in the meantime honey I'm about to sip slow watch how all this shit plays out you know what I'm saying and see what Khloe Kardashian has to say about the situation so let's go ahead and get the discussion popping go ahead and leave a comment all right deuces
Hey you guys, it's your girl T. Make sure to subscribe, like, and share my videos. You can also visit lovelytea.com to purchase any merchandise. Also, don't forget to click the boxes down below to watch any of my previous videos. Talk to y'all later. Deuces.